I've got a delivery from Daisy May Boutique. Should we get into it? So, these are a regular choice heat wave, which we will do a review of, but I thought we'd just unpack the rest of the parcel first. So, um, Daisy May, got that little leaflet here. And oh, there's a little note. I love it when they put little notes in. It's just a little note saying thank you, which is always sweet. And then I think she uses this box to stick the bag. Oh, there's other things in here as well. Right. So I bought the um, the little camera bag because I thought it was quite cute. Um, I think it's by, I think it's actually Daisy May Boutique themselves DMB Daisy Made Boutique but I don't know but I just really like it I think it's really cute and I like to take photos so I think this is quite me and I aim to be the type of person who can go out with just a bag like this like one day maybe it will happen like this is all, is all I'll take although um, how would I take photos of my, my tripod but I don't know but one day I will go out with just carrying this. It will happen. Instead of like 50 bags like I can normally do. And oh we've got some got some socks, which I didn't order. Are these a gift? Um that's really sweet. I need to double check that these are not in here by accident. Well, I'll send her the money if they are, because these are really cute. But um oh they're like little frilly socks. They're really sweet. They're quite thin as well. I like them. Usually frilly socks are like quite thick. But these, they're really, oh, we're definitely going to give them a try. So these look like, they're like little ankle socks, but with then with the frill as well. I like them. We'll definitely be trying them. And I need to double check that they're not in there by accident. And then we've got some chocolate as well, which is really nice. Thank you. Um, Marianne. That's really lovely. Thank you so very much. It looks like nice chocolate. So that's the. No, we've also got a bit of foot. <laughs> so um, that's the bag. Now, should we get to the shoes? So we've got a new box. This is spring summer 2024, and it's the first time I've seen it in person. We've got a cow. Are we getting cow shoes? I don't know. We've just had banana shoes. So maybe we are getting cow shoes. I like the tulips. I think this tulip flower design is the same design we've seen on some of the new shoes. I think it's on a banjo. And yeah, this print, I've seen it on some shoes. And um, I just reviewed it in a pair of shoes earlier. Starlight Streamers, Starlight Streamers, the um, Spring Summer 24 ones, I think they've got this pattern on them as well, which is really pretty because I've not seen it up close, but it is really beautiful. And I'm obsessed with a tulip. Tulip heel shoes would be amazing. So these are Heat Wave, and I'm going to get them out. So these are much, much cheaper. Than the regular choice trainers. The regular choice trainers probably average around £120 and these are £65 so they're kind of like half the price. So first off I wasn't expecting them to come in the proper regular choice box but they do. I thought they'd be like um like they did um they did a bed of roses and they've had other brands that were like offshoots of a regular choice that were lower budget. Um so these are actually in an irregular choice box, so that's good. And they're so pretty. Um, I was a little bit obsessed because they're kind of like Minnie Mouse, but also they're giving me Taylor Swift vibes, like friendship bracelet, which I love. And obviously you can take these beads off if you wish. And we do have ribbon laces as well if we wanted to change them. But I just love the colours. Both shoes are probably the same. both exactly the same and ooh, so this is a little bit like the sole that we had on 
It reminds me a little bit of the saw that we had on this style of shoe, but this was very inflexible and I can't wear these shoes no more because they don't move, but these are like flexible and they move and they're really light, like seriously light. I'm like a little bit obsessed. I love the colors. So we've got um, a blue um, tongue and then a, a pink polka dot fabric, purple laces and I really hope they're a good fit because they are beautiful and I love them a lot. Oh we've got like like a minty tealy green as well which is so pretty and then got all these charms which are butterflies, flowers and a heart. Are they the same charms? Yep they're the same charms on each shoe. But I love how it's got like a bead on either side of the charm. So it does give that whole um, bracelet effect. Um, so I'm going to the Euros tour um, on night one Liverpool. But I'm also planning on going night two and night three and listening from the park. And I think on one of them nights, I would probably wear these. And just go as a friendship bracelet because they very much are giving me definitely really good Taylor vibes. I think we need to try them on. Um, but first, let's do all the other stuff I'm meant to do. So RRP, £65, like I said, they come in pink. There's also a black. I think I'm going to need the black as well. I've just been looking, I just got distracted looking at the black. They come in sizes 36 to 43, so they're not part of the extended size range, sadly. But, um, and they are not exclusive to a regular choice. I got these from Daisy May, as I said, and I think some other stockists do have them, although we are running low on a regular choice stockist now. Um, I know that there's Daisy May still, and there's Captain Jellyfish who are getting some new ones, maybe still at them retro but we don't have as many as we used to. So at some point I do really need to update the stockers list and figure out where our stockers are now. Um, but these are really cute and I got influenced by Daisy May Boutique because she shared a picture of these shoes with this bag and I think that's what gives the whole I need both Taylor Swift vibes because it is giving, I don't know, it is giving Taylor and I think um, I saw my outfit out. I need a dress sparkly like this. Pink sparkly dress, these shoes, this bag, and that's why I'm wearing to come to the Euro store. Well, listen to it from the car park, because um, it's not my main outfit. But um, it's not my main outfit. Sorry, Gavin and Stacey reference. Um, but yeah, these are so pretty. I l they are so. Right, we're going to do the walk test. Oh, should we do a close up first? So you got these beads here and you've got the pink all around you've got the blue here and the laces are purple and this is does feel squishy it feels like it will be quite good for your feet um oh so they are part of the Spring Summer 2024 collection and because of that they have the Spring Summer 24 box. And paper, which is very floral. Loving the paper. Hey, right, now let's try them on.
I went for my usual size and these are a very good fit so I would say they are definitely true to size these are a 40 which is a six and a half which is what I am in most regular choice trainers and they're very comfy and really great fit um the beads are a bit of a pain in the neck when you're getting them on and off and um, just tightening and untightening the laces they get a bit stuck but they look kind of cool um so yeah i'm very impressed and for uh, like half the price of a regular pair of a regular choice trainers i think these are definitely a winner for me i would wear these in every color and why are they not an iconics why are we not getting these back year after year because they're so good and maybe they're gonna see how well they sell um when i did first see them on the website i thought that maybe the price was wrong but um i think um they are the quality is still really good but i think it's made they might be made cheaper than what the other trainers are made um so if i compare them to these for example these are much heavier than these um so i think maybe it's like lighter material less padding um lighter soles which is really good for me because um i pack a lot of shoes and i want them to be as light as they possibly can be and so i am very impressed with these i definitely want the black and um i will be getting the black at some point um and i really like them and i can't wait to wear them to liverpool and disney i think um I think these are going to go to Disney as well on the next trip because I'm not doing any Disney brands on the next trip. I'm basically like a glorified tour, tour, tour guide on my next Disney trip. And I think these are really good shoes to take anyway because they're kind of Disney but um, not in your face Disney. Which I, I'm trying to act like a, a grown up, one of them grown up people. Yeah, <laughs> in kids shoes. <laughs> these are clearly kids shoes but um, this is my version of grown up. They don't have Mickey Mouse's all over them. <laughs> so I am very happy with Heatwave um, trainers from a regular choice that I bought from Daisy May Boutique. You made it to the end. Thank you. If you'd like more shoes, more reviews, more news, what else can we get to rhyme? Then you can subscribe to this channel or you can go to the website, Instagram or Facebook. All the information is in the description of this video. Thank you very much. Bye.